Hi guys, it's Susie for Del Bellos Designs. Today I'm going to be sharing with you this piece, which I'm calling Nia into the Dragonwood. Okay, so let's go through the products. Now, for our stamps, I am using the Lavinia. We're going to be using Nia, LAB767. Lupin, LAB772. The Woodland Fern, LAB729. The Meadow Mushroom, LAB563. Medela, the small one, LAB557. The Forest Scene, LAB524. The Tree Stem, LAB643. And this little stamp from the Floral Reset, LAB637. Now, I will be using Multifarious card today. And in this case, I've got the A5 and it will be cut in half. I'm also going to be using the Acetate Circle Mask, the little one from the set. Now, for our inks, I'm using the Versifying Claire in Morning Mist, Pinecone, Nocturne, Monarch, and Shady Lane. In our Elements inks, I'll be using Olive, Sahara, Paprika, Russet Orange, and Graphite. Now, for coloring, I will be using my watercolor markers. You can use whatever it is you like. These are just some of the colors I've chosen today to go with our inks. I'm also using a yellow gel pen and some blending brushes and diamond stickles. You're also going to need some stamping blocks and a stamping platform. Okay, so let's get busy. Okay, so now we're going to blend our inks. I'm going to start with the Sahara. And because my pads are so wet, I'm going to lay some down on my mat. I'm going to take my brush and I'm just going to work that color into it. Okay, so I've let this piece dry for a little while, and now we're going to start stamping. 
So I'm grabbing my group of trees here. And we're going to stamp that up in the morning mist. So just ink it up well. All right. Now, I'm going to stamp off first, and I don't want a really clear impression of this. I just want it to appear lightly in the background. So I'm not going for a full on. That's just about perfect. I just want to give a hint that there's trees back there. So again, <clears throat> excuse me. Stamp it off. And this time I'm going to grab paper here. I'm just going to lay this down. Just to break up that edge a little bit. Again, don't go for solid because we're going to stamp more over the top of it. Just want to give a hint that there's trees. All right. And I'm going to grab my mushrooms. We're going to bring these up. Grab our little fairy here. Make sure she has plenty of room. That looks good. Put that up. And I'm going to come in with the top in Nocturne. Just the tops. If you get a little bit on the other parts, that's okay too. Then I'm going to grab my Morning Mist. I'm going to pop that down on the stems.
Now, unfortunately, while I was stamping, I ran out of storage on my camera. So you missed just a tiny bit. So I took the little stamp from the reset. I took my Monarch VersaFine Claire, and I just stamped a few pieces in here. And I did a second gen back here by the woods. So you didn't miss much, and I really am sorry about that. I apologize, and now hopefully we can get through the rest of the video without it cutting out on me. So let's get to coloring. Okay, so here we are all finished, and I'm sure that Nia is telling Lupin, hide, don't let the dragon see us. Anyways, so I took a little bit of diamond stickles and did a little bit on our wings, and other than that, I think we are done. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, I hope you give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more, hit subscribe. All the products I use today are listed in the description box down below. I'd also like to invite you to our two Facebook groups. We have Del Bello's Design Lounge, where you can post all of your Lavinia makes. We also have Del Bello's Designs a la carte. 
There you can post all your cardio, Nelly Choice, Sweet Poppy Stencil. So I hope you'll come over and join us. There's links down below to those two Facebook groups also. So until next time, stay crafty.